How does the fold change value vary between blots? As I mentioned earlier, there will be unavoidable changes per blot. But we want to make sure the variability is coming from experimental variability and not from biological differences between biological replicates. Calculate the mean fold change and standard deviations of at least three blots. The coefficient of variance or CV provides information about how variable your data are across the sample population. This value will reflect the accuracy of your findings. How do you interpret your data? A low CV value means low signal variability and high measurement precision. A higher CV on the other hand denotes higher signal variability and poor precision. High precision is critical to establish biological significance. And this is what the publishers are looking for. Furthermore, a fold change in target protein is only meaningful if the percent CV is small. In general, the percent change or fold change should be two times greater than the CV of the measurements. Thus, if the fold change is say 1.2, your percent CV should be less than 10%. Variance among biological replicates is suggestive of issues in the treatment protocol, sample aging, and or experimental design. Variance among technical replicates points to issues with reagents, methods, and protocols. A higher person CV can be corrected by re-optimizing the experimental design, reagents, and treatment protocols. 